Good day everyone! Today, we will be discussing changes in materials. Together, let's make learning science fun and easy. In these new lessons, you are expected to describe changes in the properties of materials when exposed to certain conditions such as temperature or when mixed with other materials. Effect of temperature in the phases of materials. At constant pressure, the state of materials depends on the temperature by which they are exposed. The ice cube or the solid phase of water will melt if taken out of a freezer and stayed long at room temperature. The water that boils turned into gas or vapor that comes out of the kettle if left at high temperature for too long. Temperature is the measurement of the amount of heat energy present in the surroundings. Generally, an increase in the temperature turns solid into liquid. Melting liquid into solid and that is called freezing liquid to gas that is called evaporation solid to gas that is called sublimation when materials reach its melting point solid materials change into liquid the temperature at which the liquid will change back to solid is called freezing point The melting point of ice is 0 degrees Celsius. This is also the freezing point of water. The boiling point or the temperature at which water boils and turned into gas is 100 degrees Celsius. If the change is from gas to liquid, as the temperature falls below it, it is the condensation point. Change in materials when mixed with other materials. Have you seen and tasted halo halo? Look at the picture of halo halo. What are the materials mixed to form a mixture of halo-halo? Mixture is a substance made by mixing other substances together. It is the pr product of the random distribution of one substance through another without any chemical reaction as distinct for a compound.
types of mixtures. Mixed materials can be classified depending on the appearance of the resulting mixture. When solid materials are mixed with solid materials, each of the mixed materials can be easily identified, distinguished from one another. These mixtures are called heterogeneous mixtures. Here are some examples of heterogeneous mixture. A pizza, assorted candies, a sandwich, and a fruit salad. Some solid materials, when mixed with other solid materials, cannot be distinguished from each other. This kind of mixture is called homogeneous mixture. Here are some examples of homogeneous mixture. A wine, a coffee, a juice, and a milk. Let's do this. Examine the pictures below. Identify the process that caused the materials to change. A candle will melt or melting. Ice cream is melting. A water is evaporation. An ice cube is called freezing and a moth is sublimation. Let's do this. Write the change in the state of matter materials in the pictures. A candle is solid to liquid. An ice cream is solid to liquid. A water is liquid to gas. An ice cube is liquid to solid and a mothball is solid to gas. Let's do this. Tell what type of mixtures are formed when these materials are mixed together. Salt dissolve in water. This is a homogeneous mixture. Mix toys in the room. This is a heterogeneous mixture. Paper clips and pins. This is heterogeneous mixture. Soy sauce. This is a homogeneous mixture. Halo halo. This is a heterogeneous mixture.
let's do this choose the letter of the best answer when a material was cooled what happens to its temperature a decreased b increased c disappear or d remain the same the correct answer is a Mark heated a chocolate bar to make a chocolate syrup. Which of the following describe the changes that happened in the property of the chocolate bar when it is heated? A. Shape B. Size C. A and B or D. Size but not the shape the correct answer is C. What will happen to metals when heated? A. Expanded B. Frozen C. Contracted or D. Melted The correct answer is A. When solid material is mixed with other solid material, the materials can be easily identified from one another. What type of mixture is formed? A. Homogeneous mixture B. Solid materials C. Heterogeneous mixture or D. Mixed materials the correct answer is C. What do you call the type of mixture in which the resulting mixture looked the same throughout? A. Homogeneous mixture B. Solid materials C. Heterogeneous mixture or D. Mixed materials the correct answer is A. Always remember Temperature changes the state of materials. An increase in the temperature turns solid into liquids or melting. Liquid to solid is called freezing. Liquid into gases called evaporation. Solid into gas called sublimation. And boils water at certain point is boiling point. A heterogeneous mixture is when solid materials are mixed with solid materials. Each of the mixed materials can be easily identified or distinguished from one another. While a homogeneous mixture is when some solid materials when mixed with other materials cannot be distinguished from each other. Thank you for watching. Till our next in science lesson. Goodbye.